Jorge Castañeda, and I'm going to be talking about um, the most uh, successful soccer players. Um, how many of you watch soccer, or at least watch the World Cup this summer? Okay. Um, my first one is uh, Pelé. This guy is like the legend of soccer, just like maybe Michael Jordan in basketball. Um, this guy, he's Brazilian, and um, he went to his first World Cup at, when he was 17 years old, and which he scored uh, three goals in the semifinal, and scored two goals in, in the final. Uh, this is the World Cup trophy back then, and after he won his third World Cup, they uh, gave the trophy to uh, the Brazilian like, international team, but it was lost. Somebody stole it and yeah, found it. Um, this guy, he has a thousand and two hundred goals and a and and a uh, thousand three hundred games. So, and he also won three World Cups with Brazil. Um, my next is Ronaldinho. This guy is also a beast. He played for uh, Barcelona, and he won the the uh, the World Cup in in 2002. Uh, he also won the 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 World Player of the Year, which is the Ballon d'Or. I believe it was in 2009, and that trophy is just like the best soccer player during that time. Um, he hasn't retired, and he plays for a Mexican team now, which is uh, Querétaro. And there he is, he has only 49. And he has only scored one goal with that team, and it's a, a penalty kick. Um, and that's pretty much it. Oh, he didn't uh, go to school, because he told his mom that uh, he was going to play football professionally. And there he is now. The next one is uh, Lionel Messi. Now this guy, this guy is a beast. Um, he actually won uh, four Ballon d'Ors. Um, that's uh, four um, best player of the year, four times in a row. Um, this guy has played about 500 games and has at least. 300 to 400 goals. He holds 130 individual records, and he has pretty much won every trophy, individually and a team, like except for a World Cup. That's the only trophy he needs. And well, he also needs uh, the Copa Libertadores, but Barcelona wouldn't like give, let him play with Argentina for that specific tournament. Um, here he is, he went to the, to the final in, this summer with Argentina against Germany. And even though he lost, he, got, he won the, the player of the tournament. Um, this guy, at the age of 13, he was diagnosed with, I guess, a growing disorder. Um, but his parents uh, couldn't pay um, like the medical um, stuff to to pay for like to help him grow. So FC Barcelona recruited him at the age of 13 and gave him the money and the doctors in order to him to help him grow. And now he is five foot seven, and he is for me like, the best player like today. And um, that is pretty much it. There's my references, and thank you.